Mm -hmm. before we start. Mm -hmm. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a little bit of alcohol. I'm going to clean up that top lip really good mm -hmm. so it'll smell disgusting. Okay. <laughs> necessary. helps with bruising even though bruising is super rare in the lip flip it can't mm -hmm. happen um so i'm going to have you this is your cute little refreezable one so okay. you get to take it home just put it on this top part of the lip on the side right there and get that nice and cold for me it's pink <laughs> Oh my god, I have to change my hair now. Oh my gosh. I didn't dye my hair green for St. Patrick's Day. Yeah, that'd be awesome. <laughs> that'd be good. You're funny. I'm going to wash it up. Alright, you ready? Yep. Okay, so I want you to give me a big burst. Okay, so I'm going to have you relax. Drop this bottom lip there. Okay, so I'll tell you exactly what I'm going to do. Okay. You don't have to do anything. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going to do your first injection. Take a big deep breath. Not too bad. It was so easy. Did it hurt? I told you. No, not at all. Now this second one mm -hmm. will hurt a little bit more because they're a little bit closer to, but still not that. Okay, okay. so we'll do the exact same thing. Give me a big burst. <laughs> okay, relax. So it shows me where your muscles are. on the other side and get that side nice and cold. Yeah, you did great. Yeah, that was yeah. super easy. You didn't really hear anything. It's good. Okay. okay. <laughs> See, I told you, no, no panic. Do you ever do filler under the eyes? Um, I, well, I'm not currently offering filler, but yes, you can do that. I will be offering filler in the future. Mm -hmm. I possibly would like to do that. I feel you like can. I look really tired all the time. It's just really tricky because mm -hmm. it's such a thin skin right there that you want to be careful so you don't overdo it because mm -hmm. then it can look almost the opposite, which is a little bit bulgy. Yeah. But there's many different ways that you can handle that. You can also do filler in the cheek and lift that up a little bit, mm -hmm. um, and that will that will help tint mm -hmm. that out without putting. Um, Give me some cheekbones. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's probably knock out two things at once. Oh my god. You'd be surprised how much just a little bit of sharpness there can change somebody's look. It's good. Alright, sweetheart, so I'm going to give me... Okay, so exact same thing on this side, just drop this. Yeah. Alright, take a big deep breath for me. That one hurt a little more. Mm -hmm. Really? Everybody's mm -hmm. more sensitive on that side for some reason. Alright, one last purse. Big, 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 big. Okay, relax. Drop this. Alright, last one. I'm gonna be done. Alright, give me a big deep breath. Good girl. That's it. Ta da! Is it better, yeah. worse, or same as you expected? I feel like that was great. Okay. <laughs> that, that was super easy. <laughs> See, I told you everybody feels like that. Okay. Cool. That you can take home. Mm -hmm. Can I go ahead and use it? Yeah, absolutely. And I'm not saying that it's impossible, but mm -hmm. you do run the risk of... Um, not being able to close your mouth. Yeah, or okay. the vessel is not working the way that they should be working, you have to be kind of careful around the mouth. That's why you only want to use a tiny little bit of yeah. Botox too, because if you did it, if you did it overboard, then you run the risk of it looking funny or not being able to talk properly or anything like that. So it's a stunt. Definitely <laughs> would not. Okay, how does your lips feel? 
they feel fine, honestly. I like I can feel that there's something in my lip. Did it hurt? Uh, okay, so <laughs> the first two did not hurt at all. The last one hurt the worst, and the other, like the third one, really wasn't that bad, but the last one was really bad. She gave me this little ice pack. <laughs> <laughs> And then oh you have gosh. to, you have an update appointment oh, oh. in two weeks, right? Yes. So I'll come back oh, in two weeks and we'll see what my lips look like. <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully they will actually look good. <laughs> Okay, so um, some of the issues that I've been having with my lip flip are minor. They're not like crazy, no well, they are noticeable, but it's not like something that's like going to make me crazy. Um, so one of the things I feel like I'm very self-conscious about is um, is eating. I feel like when I eat now, I feel like I eat weird. Um, so just watch my upper lip when I eat um, and tell me what you think. I feel like I look like a weirdo. I also wanted to say, I literally feel like I cannot slurp anything. So if you know what I mean, you know what I mean. Like, my upper lip cannot grasp anything. I don't even know where my vape is or I would show you like, every time I try to hit my vape, it's weird. Um, when I drink water, my lip feels weird. Like, I don't know. It kind of just like wraps itself around my bottle now, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about it, but, uh, yeah. So, we'll see. Two weeks. I feel like when I do this, you can see it. But, like, if I'm just normally talking, you can't tell that my lip has gotten bigger. It has. Hi, guys. Okay, so I just basically want to give you an update on, um, the lip flip. Today is... I believe day th three or four. I think yesterday was day four, or day three. So today has to be day four. Um, I honestly feel like I have an upper lip for once. Like it's starting to show and I'm kind of very happy. Like when I smile with my mouth closed, you can actually see that I have an upper lip. But, I don't know. Used to, when I smiled like this, this was a thin line and you really couldn't see that I had an upper lip. It was so hidden underneath. Um, there's, when I eat, I can feel, it feels different, for sure. Um, anytime I have anything in my mouth, it feels different. Um, I know that sounds weird, but I'm not, I'm not trying to sound weird. Uh, I didn't really have, I had a little bruising my friends could see. I couldn't see it, so I don't really consider myself as I got bruised from it. Um, I really didn't have any swelling. Another hard thing that I don't like is when I like lick my lips or do that. Like my, I look like a turtle. Like my lip is like, I don't know. Every time I do something, it like goes to a a point like that and I don't I don't know about that but uh so far I really like the lip flip um the lady that did it Rebecca she said that uh even if you did uh the lip flip four times in one year you still wouldn't have to pay as much as you were paying for like one syringe of filler so if you're someone like me and you have a little lip and you want to just try something new I feel like you should try the lip flip. She literally charged me, um, it's $100 for the lip flip, but when you are a first time patient, she gives you $20 off. So, 
80 bucks that's not bad from the for my first lip flip I'm like very happy with the results so far so I will give you guys a two week update soon um I think my appointment is on the 6th or the 11th or something I'm not really that sure but yeah okay see you later <laughs> huge difference um I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me take an after picture. So just nice, relax. There we go. Yeah, that, that looks, looks huge different. Looks really, really pretty. You did really good. You did awesome.